We're back, you know, viewers, you know it's a bad, it's the bad, bad, bad episode of Up Alive right now because we're joined with the reggae queen. Of course, she was on Magnum. And I know so she can talk to the people then eh, because she knows to talk to the people. Bless up yourself, reggae queen, and welcome to Up Alive. Yeah, man, it's a pleasure being here. Yeah, that rough weather. Eh? Imagine when they clash. Hmm? How, how was that, though, being a part of um, a great uh, show on TV? It was good, very good. Mm -hmm. um, but then, you know, I just started out, and it was a great platform right. for me to showcase my talent. I got a lot of exposure, experience. It was great. Okay, nice. Uh, you, you, you saw how, um, when I get back, when, when I remember his name, I'll come back to it. But where do you see yourself going in the music industry? For the music, mm -hmm. I see a lot of great things for the future. Um, I don't limit myself. Right. Yes, I just try to grab the opportunities as they come uh -huh. and put my feelings aside, whether I'm in a bad mm -hmm. mood or not, I just push forward. Don't you think like trying to push your feelings aside is somewhat about being fake or um, something? No, because um, if I have work to do, mm -hmm. and let's say I'm in a bad mood, I don't let that stop me. So I go forward. Boy! Know? Listen, reggae queen, powerful right there. So listen, I don't take her lightly. <laughs> it means uh, she's about business right here in the music industry and just for her career itself. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, do you have an intention of doing any collaboration with any artist? Yes, I do. I do. Actually, I do. <laughs> Give us an idea. Like, I mean, if you could do a collaboration right now on set, who would you choose? In terms Vibe of starter. <laughs> we, we can there's a nice one there but we can't we can give it a one that's still but i like it nice uh, inner feelings mm -hmm. you touched on it earlier but you also showed me that you're about business give the people just a little bit more on the music itself the song itself inner my feelings or inner feeling okay inner feelings is a song that speaks about my life mm -hmm. um particularly about my mom because she passed when I was 13. So I decided to write about it a little bit and, you know, step somewhat outside my comfort zone because I do hardcore dancehall. But inner feelings, it is dancehall, yes, but it's not as, you know, maybe raunchy or hardcore like right. what I normally do. So, you know, it's a, it's a change. What's the feedback been like in the streets? Ah, everyone who's heard the song actually likes it. Do they prefer um, reggae queen being, you know, the raunchy type dancehall artist out there that's bad and deal with it? Or, you know, they're, they're, they're drawing more to mm -hmm. the inner feeling type um, reggae queen? To be perfectly honest, um, they do like the raunchy side better. <laughs> but okay. it's a positive feedback because, you know, you have to be versatile. Yeah. You can't just stick to one thing. Else you'll just be in one direction, you'll just be static. So mm -hmm. you have to step outside the box. And you're also with Bad Bad Citizen. Yes, I am. Yeah, yeah, bad, I have to I have to make a lot of noise out here. You know what? Shut <laughs> them up for me now, please. Bless yeah, man. Them bad up. Bad Citizen oh. Entertainment. Big up on herself. Ricardo Allen, my manager. Kardashian, my brother Javin. Sister Novi, we just come off of the set. Cheeky Grins. Step a down over there in Canada. I'm big up on herself. And our personal DJ function. I him come at every show. I play. We redeem them. I do everything. <laughs> Beautiful boy, DJ. We need to talk to you, you know. We need to talk to you. So, so give, give, give me a little bit more, though, um, Reggae Queen. You have been doing music. You seem rather seasoned and understand the business already. And you have a positive outlook on it as well. It means for me that you have somewhere going. How do you manage mm -hmm. to keep so positive? I keep positive by just... Um, Focusing on what is more uplifting. Mm -hmm. Because if something bad happens to you and you think about it, right. then it's going to bring you down. So you have to think above that so you can rise above that situation. That's how I stay positive for me. Boy, there we have it. That was a <laughs> reggae queen representing right here on Hype TV. But you know what can't make you go in unless you... You know, she must have something, you know what I mean? She has this beautiful, melodious voice. 
very strong to you know be careful what you ask him <laughs> so you know what take over hype tv right now reggae queen bless up the people on my youtube and instagram page yeah man hype tv family and friends big up on us thanks for tuning in it's it's a pleasure being here and i'm happy that you guys are tuning in but like what you said, but guess what? You have to bust something from stage, you know. I'm putting you on the spot. Hey, is, is that <laughs> you right. ready? In our feelings now, so I'm say. Yeah, me thank God, God, say me pass it worse it it's sad When me see me my die in a hearse but time Time it heal everything so you know Father God I go reveal me blessing it never easy Mommy drop out when me a 13 Never know a daddy but that I know the worst thing And it goes on <laughs> that is certainly not the worst thing here on Up On Live either. Thank you so much, Rugger Queen. Bless up yourself. Management, bad, bad citizens, and a nice, a uh, wassa. You know, right now, we're going to go to a short break. We still have a lot of artists uh, lined up for you. Feluke, bless up yourself. Of course, he's also in studio, and we'll hear from him soon because he will be at the biggest record celebration for 2019, and that is Rubber Salute 2019. It is Friday. It is Saturday. You better make sure you stay locked to hype. We'll soon come.